Hello friends, now we will see how can we search if a value exists in an entire excel sheet. For that first, we are going to read an excel sheet using the range activity and the output will be saved it in a data table. Next, what we are going to do means we are going to use output data table activity. Why we are using output data table activity means it converts the data table into string. Now we will be able to uh, identify if the value exists or not by using dot contains method okay for this purpose we are converting the data table we read from read range into string using output data table okay now we'll go to the studio so the first step is i am going to read this excel sheet from this excel sheet we need to know if the particular value exists in that excel or not so for example let us take any value invoice number 132559 okay we going to check whether it exists or not 132559 okay first what we are doing we are just taking this read range activity in a data table called dt invoice data and then in the output data table activity we are giving dt invoice data as input and we are getting the we are saving the output in a variable called output dt okay but friends please uh, uh, notice that this variable type is not of uh, data type uh, system dot data dot data table this is a string variable okay if you look at here output dt this is a string variable not data table variable why because means once the data table is converted as string then we can use dot contains and then the value we are looking for inside it so it gives whether it contains or not inside this message box you can also use a boolean variable if it comes here you can assign it as true or you can if it goes to else part you can assign it as false now you are going to run two with the value 261633 let us go to the excel and check 261633 exists or not first let us check Two six one. Yes, it is there. Okay. Now we are going to execute this debug. Now it says value exists in Excel sheet. Now I just put on two. This value does not exist. Now it will say value does not exist. Okay, by this way you can identify whether a particular value exists in an entire Excel sheet or not. Now I will debug and show you further so that you can understand why we converted this uh, data table. We are getting this data table into string variable that is output data table. I will just go one by one. Step into So now what has happened in, in the data table invoice data this is a read range data table okay dt invoice data here what has done means all the value is captured that is the whole excel value is captured in the data table it is in the form of data table format okay rows and columns now you see still output data table is not given any value this is the output dt first one you check okay it is null now let us see how it comes step into now output data table activity is finished let us go to the locals and check the output data table see it is just a string okay all the data table value is converted into string so now we can easily use dot contains and then we can give the value whatever we are looking for so this is the reason we are converting the data table into string using output data table activity Thank you friends, if you like this video, please subscribe and support and like and comment. Thank you friends.